Hello everyone! Today we'll take a look at the best JBL speakers in the market for 2021. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I'll try to help you find the right one for your needs. To see the most up-to-date prices and find out more information about these speakers, you can check out the links in the description below. Before we start, I have a question for you guys. Which speakers are you using right now, and what's your opinion on them? Let me know in the comments. Number 5. JBL Flip 4 – Best for the Money JBL is one of the biggest brands in the Bluetooth speaker market, if not the biggest already, and its Flip line has been one of the most notable products from its lineup. The JBL Flip 4 is one of the most popular products on Amazon, with over 7,000 reviews on the site, amazing soundscape for such a small speaker, great battery life, and plenty of other desirable qualities that make it the absolute best Bluetooth speaker in the sub $100 price. If you've seen any of its predecessors, the design of the Flip 4 is not a surprise. With its cylindrical shape that's 6.9 inches high and measures about 2.75 inches in diameter, it's a little taller than its predecessor, and at the same time it's more rugged and durable thanks to its plastic end caps that are included in the design. You'll spot the playback and Bluetooth buttons on the side, and on the back of the device you'll spot the battery life lights. The micro USB port and the 3.5mm aux port are under the waterproof flap. The sound performance of the JBL Flip 4 is amazing, delivering a deep bass, clear mids, and pretty sharp highs, which is the area that has improved the most from its predecessor. The vocals were its strongest point, and the bass was pretty powerful for such a small device. Number 4. JBL PartyBox 310 – Best Party Speaker So this is the new JBL PartyBox 310. It's rocking both cosmetic and performance improvements from the PartyBox 300, and overall I really do think the PartyBox 310 is a good upgrade from the original 300. So, if you're looking for a big speaker for your man cave, or if you moonlight as a DJ, you could try this one out. The JBL PartyBox 310 has satisfactory controls. They're easy to press and intuitive to use. You can adjust the volume and play or pause audio. The play button can be pressed twice to skip to the next track, or pressed three times to skip to the previous track. Now, even though I know it might be tempting to go with the 300 and save $100, I honestly think in the long run you're going to be better off just picking up the 310 instead because it's going to make your life a whole lot easier. But either way, there's a link below, just in case. The JBL Party Box 310 is good for music. It has a slightly boomy sound profile that you can add even more bass to using its bass boost feature. It can also play stereo content, and it can get really loud, although there are slight compression artifacts at max volume. Unfortunately, it lacks more robust sound enhancement features like a graphic EQ. Number 3. JBL Boombox 2 the loudest. So JBL is very well known for delivering portable Bluetooth speakers, but if you want the most volume from their lineup, you have to take a look at the JBL Boombox. This is one of the loudest speakers in the market, coming with good old 80s Boombox style body as its name implies, tons of performance, large drivers, great soundscape, and tons of value for its price. If you want the most volume and bass from a Bluetooth speaker, this is it. In the device, you'll find two 20mm forward-firing speakers, and on the sides, you'll see the 4-inch woofers. The JBL Boombox weighs a hefty 11.6 pounds in total, and on the front face, you'll see the playback controls, connect plus button for recreating a full sound system with other JBL speakers, and on the back, you'll see the connectivity ports that are covered with a nice waterproof flap. I also like the overall performance of the device, which delivered amazing bass with great power and depth, with high gain and volume without any distortion. This is only possible due to the digital signal processing technology that balances the bass at high volumes, and due to that, we're left to experience the excellent bass, perfect for any party, especially for pool parties due to its waterproof body. Number 2. JBL Flip 5 – Best Runner-Up The Flip 5 is marginally bigger and heavier than its elder sibling, but we hardly notice the difference. The new racetrack-shaped driver hiding under its jacket is 4mm wider in diameter, 44mm from 40mm, and the Flip 5 also features 20 watts of amplification, so you also get an extra 4 watts of power over the Flip 4. There's no cover for the USB-C charging port, and though it is waterproofed, it isn't tested against salt or sand ingress at the beach. JBL claims that you'll get 12 hours of constant playback with the JBL Flip 5, and in our testing, we got 9 hours and 25 minutes, which isn't bad at all, but falls just short of the claimed 12 hours. Still, that's more than enough for an average day at the beach or a good day hike. 
Throughout the same song, the shakers and cymbals throughout the background of the song sounded more like weird hisses than cymbals, just because of how low and unclear they were. The JBL Flip 5 is a simple soul, perhaps too simple for some in this world, but that minimalist approach has allowed JBL to focus on performance and create one of the best-sounding budget portable speakers around. Number 1. JBL Charge 4 – Best All Round As our top pick, we have the latest JBL Charge 4, which shouldn't come as a surprise considering the amazing performance of its predecessor. This makes some interesting improvements on the already excellent Charge 3, bringing amazing and better sound to the table, which the former struggled with a little. If you saw the Charge 3, the Charge 4 will be familiar to you, and it's pretty hard to find differences in the design department if you don't know what you're looking for. However, in my opinion, the design of the JBL Charge 4 is a little more refined and streamlined as it comes with confidence. Its side woofers are still exposed, but they're safer than from the predecessor, and while it has a pretty directional sound, thanks to its loudness, this device can fill out a room without any problem. The biggest improvements come in the sound performance. The speaker comes with an ultra-balanced sound that's very pleasing to the ear and will work excellently with every single genre. Unlike its predecessor, which had a lacking treble performance, this one delivers pretty sharp eyes and is the definite best speaker in the JBL lineup. Buying Guide Audio Quality I don't think anyone would settle buying a Bluetooth speaker, even a super affordable one, if it didn't deliver a good sound quality. For that reason, I suggest everyone that can't test sound devices in person read extensive reviews from trusted sources and watch demonstration videos, like this one. However, some specifications can give you some hints about the sound quality of a certain device. For example, the output power measured in watts is a great indicator of whether a speaker can deliver enough sound. The other one is the frequency response range, which is measured in hertz. This is also a good one since it'll show you the sound capability of the speaker. In addition to that, impedance and channels can be signs of the quality of a Bluetooth speaker. Size Suppose you're planning a romantic getaway, and you don't plan to check in, so you have to fit everything in your hand luggage. Where will I put that huge speaker? It wouldn't have happened to you with a compact wireless speaker. Many companies have developed ultra-light and compact Bluetooth speakers that'll fit anywhere in your luggage. You can take those things anywhere you want without even thinking about it. Portability Bluetooth speakers are very interesting animals since there are a lot of them in the market and everyone can find one for their needs. One of the most important features in my opinion is the portability, since most of us buy these devices for our trips or vacations. It's nice having some of your favorite tunes pumping when you're sunbathing on the beach or while you're hiking in nature. For that reason, I try to list the dimensions, shape and weight of every Bluetooth speaker I review so you know if it's feasible to get and pack in your backpack or luggage.